So how are you doing with your goals? You know, it's been about a month since you probably set your goals for the year. So are you really doing great? Are you successful? Or maybe you are getting tired. Maybe you've dropped the ball a little bit and maybe you need a shot in the arm so that you can get across the finish line. And that's what we're gonna do today. I wanna share with you my start plan. And this plan is gonna help you get across that finish line. Okay, so let's just review really quick. You can watch the previous videos and I've listed those below in the, in the description. But the start plan, and I've also got free printables, so be sure to go to my website at harvestinghome.com so that you can get those printables because you can plan out your goals and you wanna be able to get those free printables um, so that you can begin to plan those things out if you haven't done that already. Uh, we wanna get you across the finish line. So let's look at the start plan. So the very first thing is set small goals. The second one, which you're gonna talk about today is T, train your mind for the finish line. And then we've got A, access available resources or acknowledge small victories. R is replace bad habits and T is today, don't delay. But today we want to talk about that T, which is the first T, train your mind for the finish line. And it's kind of ironic because, you know, we first started this series at the very beginning of January. And, you know, when we, we always set goals at the beginning of January, we all do that. We want to um, start the new year off. We, we set high goals and we just are ready for a new beginning. And it just seems like obstacles always just come up and, I don't know, by the end of January, something happens and those goals that we've set somehow just have fallen by the wayside or we just don't have the same energy and the same excitement to get across the finish line. And so for us personally, with the start plan, we were so excited and we had this plan just ready to go and to share and to do all of these videos and to share them with you. And, you know, we had this, um, this thing come up, this, this illness that shall not be named. And uh, it caused us to have um, kind of this two week uh, stay home time, this time, <laughs> this period. And, um, and so it really put a delay on a lot of, of the things that we had planned. And you know, that's gonna happen in life. And you know, I just really encourage you to just remember that's okay. Things are gonna come up and you're gonna have obstacles in your path, but that's why you have to have your eyes on the finish line. And so all those obstacles that come in your path, if you have your eyes on the finish line and not what's just right before you, and those obstacles, then when you're past that, then you just keep running and you keep running that race and you're gonna get to the finish line. And that also goes, goes back to those setting small goals. So you see, um, even though we had those obstacles come up, we had already set small goals and we could accomplish those small goals and get and move on to the next goal and keep moving on to that next goal until it takes us to the finish line. And so that's why it's so important to set those small goals because it just keeps getting us closer and closer to the finish line. So when those obstacles come up, because you've set small goals, you just look at the next goal that you want to meet. You don't just throw it all out the window um, because you've lost um, one month maybe or one week or two weeks of um, frustration or maybe a sickness or um, something that you didn't expect that caused you to really forget about your goal or maybe um, a, lo a job lost. You know, there's so many different things that cause us to maybe you were uh, wanting to pay off your debt and there was a job loss and that's frustration and you want to keep your eye on the finish line but your income has been severely impact impacted so i would just say continue to set small goals don't give up and look reevaluate sometimes we have to reevaluate what the final goal is going to be and maybe the timeline has to change adjust your goals but don't give up that's what I wanna tell you is don't give up on your goals. Just reevaluate, adjust your timeline and continue to set those small goals so that you can get across the finish line. So I wanna tell you that I'm here for you. I'm cheering you on and I know that you can do it. 
I just want to say thank you for joining us and thank you for being a part of our channel. If there's any way that we can support you, uh, please let us know. And I hope that you will like this uh, video and that you will subscribe to our channel. Be sure to tell your friends about us and uh, encourage them to come and to watch the videos and maybe it'll be an encouragement to them. And I would love for you to comment on the videos and let us know maybe some of the goals that you have this year and ways that, that you are setting your mind on the finish line. Let us know how we can support you. Thanks for watching today.